recording for Kids First, and today I'll be reviewing the film Red Shoes and the Seven Dwarfs. Red Shoes and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic fairy tale with a modern twist, or rather, many of them. It's an outrageous spoof on several fairy tales centered around Snow White, except this princess rescues all seven of her would-be fearless heroes. Red Shoes begins when Snow White spies a tempting red apple, and when she goes to pluck it, the apple transforms into a pair of red shoes, which alters her appearance when she wears them. Meanwhile, a witch's curse transforms our seven fearless heroes into dwarves, who now must seek the princess to break their spell and return them to their glorious former selves. Together, they must find what they are looking for and learn that true beauty lies within. My favorite character is Snow White, aka Red Shoes, played by the talented Chloe Grace Moretz. Her voice is so rich and she adds so much life and magic to this character. You feel her pain and doubt in some scenes, and there is a great connection with Snow White and Merlin, Sam Claflin. Sam Claflin also gives an amazing performance, so much that I will say that I've been to Merlin, which his character would be happy to know. The voiceover talents in this film really bring this story to life, which includes the fabulous Gina Gershon, Regina, and Jim Rash as a snotty prince average, not average, with of course, his foppish pronunciation. Voice direction is overseen by the talented Tony Bancroft, who, who leads the amazing voice cast. This is an animated film, so of course the animation team deserves recognition as well. Character design and animation comes from Jin Kim, and I love how the characters are modernized and portrayed. Music really drives some of the emotional scenes and is Emmy award-winning composer, Geoff Zanelli. My favorite song in this movie is the start of something right. The message of this film is that beauty comes in all shapes and sizes, and what a message that is. First impressions can and sometimes should be changed as actions can speak the truth of your heart. After all, you can be different on the outside from what you feel on the inside. I rate this movie four out of five stars and recommend it for ages four to 13. Red Shoes and the Seven Doors is available now on digital and on demand in homes and castles far, far away. And to own on Blu-ray and DVD September 22nd, 2020. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to watch all of my interviews and reviews, as well as those of our many other talented Kids First reporters. Catch you next time. Bye now! Red Shoes and the Seven Dwarves. <laughs>